The government and the Congress party are on the same page when it comes to talks with team Anna, specifically Anna Hazare. Both the government and the Congress party are against negotiations at this stage. Remember, your law minister Salman Khurshid, he made his point very clear. Now the Congress party has said they are on the same page with the government. Government stands firm in the face of Anna Hazare's do or die fast at Jantar Mantar. Headlines today's deputy editor Kartike Sharma joins me for more on this. Kartike, this time, whether it's the government or the party, they're on the same page. Salman Khurshid said even I'm on a fast. We are keeping our rosas. You see, uh, the reason why uh, both Congress and government are on the same page because this time around you don't require a good cop, bad cop policy. Uh, last time they felt that they required some polit politicians to monitor the Anna whereby they could keep the dignity of the government by taking a hard stand. But they know that uh, the uh, negotiation has already failed. Uh, Mr. Zafar had a meeting with Salman Khushid. There was a prior commitment between them. That's why the letter by Mr. Narayan Swami was released in the press, uh, which was written in Hindi. But then uh, later to the horror, the government realized that uh, uh, <coughs> Mr. Kejriwal and the other people prevailed upon Anna Hazare and the deal was broken. So uh, that is why government does not want to take any uh, uh, step by uh, uh, negotiating with them so that people get an idea that they are bending. Uh, and the reason is very simple, Gaurav, and it is that you have a you have a select much, select committee in motion. And unless and until the report is out, the government is in no position to give any guarantee because constitutionally, committee has a life of its own and it's sovereign. It's only answerable to the, not to the executive. Okay, stay on with me. Let me also bring in Ankit Tyagi at this stage. Ankit, Anna Hazare and his entire team are now coming together to say this is a do or die moment. There are people who are on stage say, will you let Anna die? The government clearly this time isn't budging. What's team Anna's strategy? I uh, got uh, you know, even before this fast uh, had started, team Anna had made it very clear that uh, this time they are not going to negotiate. Uh, you know, uh, if, if, if you if you ask me of my experience of reporting with team Anna and uh, whatever I have gathered from the sources, this movement is actually not about uh, getting those demands met. It is about establishing Team Anna as a force. It is about uh, telling the country that the government has absolutely done nothing in one and a half year uh, for the Jan Lokpal bill and to take this momentum to the 2014 elections. Uh, this is the first time Team Anna has been very clear that they will be supporting candidates in 2014 elections. Uh, just a while back when Arvind Kejriwal was on the stage, for the first time, Arvind Kejriwal from the stage almost hinted about the political ambitions of Team Anna. He said that uh, uh, there is no future with Congress and the BJP and people should not vote for them. Rather, they should come and join their team. Clearly hinting that 2014 people should be ready. If okay. Team Anna gives them a political uh, platform, they should be ready to support that and they will be an alternative to Congress and BJP. That is what they are aiming at. That is the positioning that they are aiming at with this part. Okay, an alternative to both the Congress and the BJP. That is what Team Anna appears to be aiming for. Kartike, the government this time more comfortable than it ever was in the past. Is it because the crowds comparatively lesser this time or is there a lot of fatigue that seems to have uh, set in that there is no forward movement when we go through these motions every couple of months why is it that the government is far more comfortable than it ever was in the past uh, crowd yes a politician always yeah to the crowd the crowd would have been for 40,000 or 50,000 you would have seen politicians singing at a few altogether yes crowd is one basic indicator uh, secondly, there is nothing to negotiate. I think Team Anna is also taking a very hard stand and I completely agree with Ankit. This is less about Lokpal Bill and more about establishing Team Anna as a political force. So once you say that you are a political force and, and, and the end of the organization is not uh, one legislation, then, then the whole, uh, I would say the thought process for a political party becomes okay. You okay. want to fight elections. We'll see that in 2014. That's a pity because we have got mandate because if you are a political party, then you are, yeah. then you have to go by the mandate. 